Hi guys, in this tutorial, we're going to discuss about PyODPC and learn how to read its data using Pandas and CSV. So now, without any further ado, let's get started. To start with, as you recall our discussion last time, I create a PyODBC that reads its data to Excel. This time, I'm going to create another session using Pandas. And this time, we're going to export this as CSV. So let's start. So now I'm going to create a new file, which is lesson3 underscore PYODBC dot py okay now the first thing we need to do is we need to import first our pandas as pd then I'm going to import our py odbc so for connections I'm going to use our lesson to section lesson I'm going to copy to this line here I'm going to paste here so this is the same with the connection that we're still using right now next I'm going to pull the cursor so that need to pull cursor equals to on dot Person. Okay. This time, I'm going to call the SQL query, SQL query. Then I'm going to call our pandas here. So PD, then read SQL query. In pandas, this is how you you query the course in what data or what database that you're using. For now we're going to call this select all from our database copy by ODBC that PBO here and student. Okay, so next for this one, we need to call the connection. Just to make sure. Okay, as a refresh, we need to emphasize that this is our database. I created in SQL Server, which is this is my database, and this are and this is my table, and with the sample data. Okay, so let's continue. So now. After I call this uh, SQL uh, query, the next thing we need to do is to convert this into CSV. To do that, you need to type TO, now, then CSV. So for this one, I'm going to call this all underscore data that CSP. Then this time I need to assign an index. Index to false. Okay. No more index. Okay, so let's review again our code. So from here we import our pandas and PyODBC. Make sure always check if this package is installed by using pip or by typing pip install and the name of the package. So since I already installed this in a previous example, so that's how you do it. Next, we call our connection here, then assign that in our cursor cursor 
Then using the pandas, it's a PD here, I read the or it reads the SQL query. This is our SQL query. And assign the connection. This time, all those connections will be print out or convert to CSV. And this is the file name all data dot csv let's try by lesson three underscore three let's go for the for the pc rather by odpc dot py and enter there you go so once you enter here, it will generate a new file, which is the all data.csv. If I click this one, there you go. Also, if you want this to preview in Excel Viewer, you can simply right, uh, right click here as right click, open preview. There you go. Now, for those who don't understand or didn't uh, get this part here, check on lesson two on how to install this extension, which is the Excel Viewer. So now, that's it guys. If you found this video informative, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. See you guys on the next video series. Cheers.